Today we are here to support our federal, state, and local explosive detection canines in this area by offering them the National Odor Recognition Test. What that is, it's a test to make sure that these explosive canines can find basic explosive odors. Some of the dogs and, and agencies here don't have access to some of the explosives that are used in real world threats these days. So we are here to make sure that they can find those. So these dogs have all gone through an annual certification. But back in 1997, Congress passed a law making us uh, or allowing us to create a national standard. And that's basically why we're here to make sure that all explosive dogs throughout the country can find basic explosive odors. It's extremely important in this day and age because in situations like the Boston bombings, there's, they, you know, they used simple products that some people don't even think about using. So another part of our, why we are here is we are educating them on the different types of explosives that are being used for you know, bombings. We teach them about contamination of explosives and then we also train them on homemade explosives, stuff that they may find in the military sense in theater when they deploy overseas. So our chemists from our laboratory, laboratories create homemade explosives and we have them transported out here safely and we are able to offer that to them to make sure that their canine can find that, that explosive odor. Well, the dog has to, to, has to want to hunt and look for and, and have a drive is what we call it. They have to have a drive for working and that's why you will see Labrador Retrievers, Belgian Malinois, and German Shepherds out here mainly this week because they have such a, a strong drive to work. Um, you know, you can't get a, a pug out here because they, they just don't have that drive. There's, there's a difference in, in, in what kind of dog best suits this type of application. And, and you know, these guys go home with this dog every single day, and ladies, they go home with this dog every, these dogs every single day. Um, their life depends on them. And, and that's why we're here to support this, uh, you know, our state and local partners to prevent violent crime and uh, ensure that the citizens of this state are safe.